Now look at these creatures here. These are called sea anemones. Now the one over on your left, he's taking a little rest, a little snooze, right? He's uh, just taking a little sleep. But the one over the right, he is hunting. He has these tentacles out in the water and he's waving them around. And what he's doing, he's not waving high at you. What he is doing is he is hunting. He is looking for food. And the way he does it, you look at these uh, little tentacles, on the end there's a little capsule there. Kind of looks like a balloon. When you cut that capsule open, inside what you find is a dart a very sharp dart filled with a big sack of poison. In fact, it's a poison dart. Then there's a big spring system. Up at the top, there's a trap door, and there's a little trigger. Now, here's what happens. A little fish comes swimming up, gets too close to the sea, and then he hits the trigger. The trap door flies over. The poison dart shoots out, and it sticks that little fish and fills him full of poison. And the spring holds on while it all takes place. Now, if it's a small fish, it kills him pretty quick. If it's a large fish, it paralyzes him or puts him to sleep. But in any case, that is lunch. Here, a starfish got just a little bit too close. But I want you guys to look at that mechanism one more time, that poison dart system. Take a good look at that. Does that look like something that happened by chance and accident, or does that look like something that happened by design? See, I have to vote intelligent design. That is, that is evidence of a creator.